Ooh, legendary chest, and it's a big legendary chest. What? I mean, I'm stuck against the wall, almost died, but yeah, I'm healing up very fast. Hang on, he has a... Huh, that's strange. Okay, yeah, that's something too. He's a waste on his head. Okay. And welcome back to some more Enshrouded. Right. Now, thanks to Enshrouded and a little bit of myself, I've managed to become a YouTube partner. So you may have noticed that now next to the subscribe button, there's a member button and there's also a thank you button. But again, I mean, I'm just gonna say straight out that all of my content will always be free. So it's up to you what you do with this information. You can get maybe an emote. I made it in paint. Took me a whole, <laughs> uh, probably 10 minutes per emote. <laughs> so yeah, get your money's worth. <laughs> oh God, maybe someday, maybe someday I'll make some proper beneficial stuff if you want to become a member. Now, if you do, I, you will have my greatest gratitude. Right, right, okay, on, on, on to the business, the business of Enshrouded. So we figured out yesterday, thanks to the comments, that there are some bugged lore, so, but I still think there's something out there. I mean, we do manage to find something every time we explore. Now, I still have a lot more building to do. I will probably do that a little bit here and there, but right now, explorations. Yes, let's -a go. Now, the only question is where? Where are we supposed to explore? <sighs> because I feel like I have been absolutely everywhere. When I see at other people's building videos, mostly, I mean, I'm starting slow and steadily to watch other creators as well. There are some really good ones out there, but all of their maps are, you know, have the fog of war on them. So I do believe that I explore more than most people, but I still haven't found everything. Now, there was a comment, let's see, there was a note in Moss Grove that referred to the ghost, maybe? Some screaming and such? Now, I do believe that I've gotten that book. Or note, I think. But we're gonna have a little look anyways. Uh, okay. Hmm. I should test on a new character. Okay, after we double check... Hang on, that was birds. After we check uh, the lore in Moss Grove, we might as well test on a new character just to do the experiment, because I don't think that I did that in yesterday's video. Okay, that, that's the ghost, right? And a schmeck. Yeah. Okay, so the ring, yeah, the ring is guaranteed. I've gotten it so many times by now. Let's see. Okay, so here's the note. Come back to me. Sophie, I know you're still out there. Our hero cries at night from the deep in the shroud. Did you truly need to flee? I'm sorry for all that I said. Pray, forgive me. Come back if you're still there. We miss you. Yeah, I do remember. Hang on. I remember that I read that note during the night. And then I said, yeah, I jumped over here and I said something to like, stuff. if she's out here, then she's dead. I believe so. That was a very long time ago. So, okay, maybe. I need to look through the videos. I mean, I have so many videos now that I don't even remember in which video I did it. But yeah, it's weird if I hadn't gotten this ring already. And if I did, what did I do with the ring? Huh, okay. Ooh, well, better, okay. Come back to me. Sophie, I know you're still out there. I, I hear your cries at night from the deep in the shroud. Did you truly need to flee? I'm sorry for all that I said. Pray, forgive me. Okay, come back if you're still there. I miss you, Sophie. I don't remember no Sophie. But if she's out here, she's probably dead. Right, yeah, their stuff is starting to come back to me. My memory is not what it used to be, but yeah. Actually, I don't have to travel back. I can just log out, right? Okay, so if we log out, and then, let's see, if we go to... Well, it's still my main world, but let's just do speed. Uh, what's... Test, maybe? Yeah, testicles. I haven't given him a go in quite some time. Let's see, if we go to lore here, Alchemist Series 1, it beckons of light. Ancient Spire, the beacons of light. So I've discovered the thing down here. Yeah, I do remember that I did that because I was testing whether or not you could get experience. Yeah, because this book is no longer, it's no longer active. Okay, uh, where is it? It's right over here. Now, does this book still glow, does it? No, it does not. And if I read it, the elix as well, no, no. Okay, what about yet another character? 
Okay, double check the lore. Okay, I have nothing. So if I try to s get to this thing, yeah, I can fast travel over there. Okay, let's uh, travel back here. Let's just first off check the loot. Check the loot, check the lore. If we go over here now, right, okay, so this lore should still be, yeah, okay, so this is glowing, right, righto. I mean, there's probably something that you can do in the game files. Ooh, talking about game files. Now, I've seen a lot of uh, sponsored videos from Keen Games with popular creators playing the game for the first time and building awesome stuff. No, that is very fun to watch. But I've noticed something, that they have a lot of building materials. Now, of course, you could cheat in the game, but... I also figured out quite fast that in the Discord you could just, well, copy a world. And there's loads of, you know, like, creative worlds around there. So basically you just uh, download one of those worlds, log in, get all the building materials that you need, and get into your own world. Right. And I do enjoy that Keen Games is spending money on advertisements. Yes, that is, that is very good. Means, and that means that they're not just taking the money and running, they're, they're taking the money and investing it into the game. Oh, oh boy, it's gonna, ow, it's gonna be fun to see where this game ends up. Okay, I think I need to enable the HUD to see, okay, what do I get here? Let's see, Ancient Spire, Beacons of Light. I got some experience, and, and... Or the Ancient Spire Beacons of Light. Okay, so now I have that, but it didn't pop up here. Okay, and then let's travel to that other place. Now, is this book still glowing red? It is not. Okay, so they are connected, and reading this means nothing. Righto. Okay, hmm. That's, uh, that's something. Right, and there's nothing... Like, if I drink this, it doesn't help. If it's on the floor, it doesn't help. Okay, well, at least we tested that. That is good. Now we know. Okay, well, guess we just need to wait for an update for it, for them to fix that. Hang on. <sighs> yeah, I did try to go into another world, didn't I? Yeah, I did do that. Didn't I? <laughs> oh, God. Okay, one more time. If I take a new character, let's see, speed two, maybe? And then we go into a random world. Let's say speedrun 2. What's gonna happen now? <laughs> oh boy, is this gonna be a waste of time. Let's have a look, see. Because in the lore, I have Alchemist Series 2, which means nothing. And if I read this now, let's say Alchemist Series, new general, yeah. On Elixir, well, the springs of Elixir. Okay, what did I get? Lore, general, Alchemist Series, no. Okay, yeah, so this one is bugged, okay. Well, we did the testing that we could do. I could also report this bug. What happens if I press this button? Well, it just took me to the website, right? Okay, well, I'll do that later. At least now I have showcased the bug. So hopefully they do something about it. I mean, it's, it's just lore. It's not like it's game-breaking. Okay, no? Wrong world. Ah, well, uh, no, no. Enough is enough. Enough testing. We need to explore more. Yeah, that's the right character. Just need the right world. And of course, some chemicals. Okay, well, might as well hide the HUD and get back to business. Right, where should I try? Right, okay, because what I'm searching for right now is the lore that would show the location of the Hollow Halls dungeon. Now, most likely it would be here, right? Where's the wolf? I thought there was a wolf here. Loads of explosions. Now there's a chest underneath here. Yep. Even though it's nothing, I kind of need to loot it. And of course, more explosions. Okay, there's, there's the doggo. Rookmore. I was there too. That is the place that would make most sense to show the location of the Hollow Halls dungeons. Right? Because it's fairly close. Then again, mm, I mean, we're supposed to be like level, what, four or something at this area? I'm not sure. And some explosions. Explosions? Yes. And more explosions, maybe? Yes, more explosions. Right, okay, you may have noticed some time has passed, and I haven't really moved that much, but yes, stuff happens. But we're gonna travel a little bit at night, because the darkness does help a little bit when it comes to finding some lore. 
this would be something, right? Now, hang on a minute. This looks very suspicious. What do we have here? That is a sign of something. I have yet to learn the signs, but yeah. Okay, now this is 100% something. Might as well hide the HUD because of aesthetics. Yes. Ooh, legendary chest. And it's a big legendary chest. What? Shepherd's Lightning level 3 eh, at this area. Now I'm just gonna check for the sake of checking. Yeah, it is still the same old, same old. Okay, but there's a road that goes down. Where does this lead? That's probably over there again. But yeah, we're gonna check out the wood guard. Even though we were here yesterday, it could still be something. Maybe, just maybe. I do you remember a note here? Hidden building blocks, yeah. That's just the hidden building blocks, and that's at the top of this uh, thing, I believe, yeah. And in Woodguard, there should be nothing. Hang on, scavenger stash. Maybe? Okay, where's the stash? Uh, scavenger stash? Yeah, this place. Legendary chest with... I have Wailing Blade, I already forgot about that. I mean, that sword is... Uh, it is level 3. Huh. 14 damage. Okay, I'm just thinking if I ever were to do a second playthrough, if I would just immediately go for the dragon sword. Because I. Oh, traps. Because I do believe explosions. I do believe they should do something about the log in and out glitch. Not necessarily a glitch. I mean, it's intended game mechanics. But at least I hope they add something better that you have to craft. And I still can't believe that I haven't discovered birds in the game before. Okay, so this place. Hmm. Maybe. Let's check out this cave. First encounter with a bear. Where's the bear? Uh, bear? What is the Wooka bear? Monkey. Wooka bear monkey? Monkey bear Wooka. There's supposed to be a bear inside there. Hang on. Uh, maybe the wolves killed him. Okay, those are bears. Are they different colors? They seem a little bit more brown now. Probably just my imagination. Okay, here's the chest. And now it's morning? What? I heard a cock a doodle do. I am waiting to be surprised. I would like to be surprised, please. Okay, so no surprises yet. Traps. Ow. Double ow. <laughs> oh god. Okay, let's look for some secrets, maybe. Come on, secrets and wonder. Ooh, fancy. Yeah, nothing down here. This is probably where the hunter is. Now, the rest of these have been open, right? Now, would that say, or would that mean that there is more survivors? Where could the lore be in that shows the location? The Hollow Holes dungeon? Because if this is like level 3 area, where's level 10? Or are you supposed to be low level when you head into the Hollow Holes? Maybe you're supposed to be higher level? Who knows? Well, I have proven that you can go into them at extremely low level. Yeah, 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 yeah. Bastard. No, no arrow for you. Oh, almost. Headshot. And another headshot. And another headshot. Yes. Yeah, when I build my Dwarven Kingdom, which I eventually will do, I need to make some skylights. Because the lighting does look extremely good in this game. What was down here? Salt? Yeah, there's a little bit of salt right here. Okay, so you can get salt earlier. Yeah, I, I believe that I knew that. Maybe. Hang on. Oh, treasure. Yeah. Another one of these. At <laughs> this low level. Okay, yeah, I, I do find it strange. Now, I do believe I need to make another immortal build, but I kind of wanted to work with this costume. And this is not the warrior set at all. I mean, I could go for the soldier set, since it is, has basically the same stats as the paladin set. And it doesn't look too glorified. I mean, I must say that this set doesn't look too bad. That it does not. Just lose a little bit of health. Uh, okay, let's see. Stamina regeneration. That could be maybe something. Hmm... This is just one damage. Okay, not too bad. I'm not too big of a fan of the helmet. It looks like a knight that I do. And I still have the pants just for the sprint speed without the helmet. Okay, yeah, that's that looks a lot better. But this is like... That's a lot of melee damage. So 12% more melee damage, eh? I mean, it doesn't look too bad. I don't like the way that it sounds. I mean, it's chain mail whenever I walk around. Uh, and let's see, have I specced into, yeah, I do believe, I mean, I could spec even more into melee, and also a lot more into that, eh? Mm -hmm. Let's see, do we have a nice, okay, maybe we will try that thing. We do also have, where's the flesh grinder? 
There we go. Okay, I just want to give the hollow holes a quick go with this build, just to see. Uh, Kindle waste. We will see. How fast will I die? Ah, might as well buff off on some potions since I do have that, right? A little bit more stamina. A little bit more of that. Anything more? Ah, man, might as well use some magic. Other than that, I don't think I need much, right? What is this? Ice protection? Uh, why not? And might as well just some shroud. And hang on. One thing that I could also do. Okay, the Vuka encampment that I'm thinking of, or the Vukar buff, should be right in front of the Dragon Cave. Do I remember that correctly? There we go, right. 20% more melee damage, right? Okay, this does 200 now. Uh, what about this? About the same. Now, I don't think I have... No, I don't have the legendary hammer from the... Okay, I just saw something weird right before I logged off. I need to double check that. Uh, let's see. Yeah, I do have... Where is it? Where is it? I mean, I have this thing. Uh, I might as well take that. It doesn't hurt. Where's the sword? This thing. Sacrilegious sword, eh? Uh, I might give it a go. Okay, and then we just repair. Now we're ready. Yeah, quick attempt. I do look a little bit fancy. That I do. Okay, let's give it a go. Come on. All the holes. I forgot the food buff, but that's fine. Okay, where are they? There we go. Okay, that's something. Hmm. Okay, not bad. Not bad at all. I heal, like, quite a lot. But yeah, I also forgot about the rings. Okay, let's just travel back and be quick about it. These two. Two Gemini rings. I'm not too much of a fan of whenever I walk. I sound like I have a bunch of chain in my pocket. But yeah, let's find some enemies. Like these ones. I do heal up good. Not too much. What about the flesh grinder? Yeah, okay. It depends on my damage. I mean, sometimes I heal for 143. Okay. Okay, what about this? Boy, is that a lot of healing. I mean, with multiple enemies, this is a breeze, right? Okay, gather them up. I mean, I'm stuck against the wall, almost died, but yeah, I'm healing up very fast. Not doing the most damage, but the healing is very neat. Get back here, you. Yeah, that's a lot of damage. That's a ton of damage. Very much damage. I'm not sure how much the Gemini rings help, because a total of 16% healing chance, I mean, it is something. I mean, I would do a lot more damage with the two-hander. Yeah, that's a lot of healing. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, this is a lot of healing. And so much damage, eh? I mean, I'm just surging through here. Might as well repair. A little bit more flying. Hang on, is there something here? Oh, hidden stuff. Have I discovered this before? Oh, no, I haven't. Ooh, okay, hidden stuff. You say? Okay, level 25. I wanted legendary, but that's fine. Is there more? Anything behind here? Have, ha, have I not been here already? Really? Uh, there's a book, but that's just dismantling. Uh, let's see. Anything behind here? Might as well use one of these, since we're here. Uh, let's see. Nothing behind that thing. You can just sit on the throne. Aha! Hang on. Here's something hidden. Hidden stuff galore. Wait a minute. What is this then? It's a way down. Oh, holy bolts. Secret. I thought. Okay, it goes further down. Let's see, I do have bombs. Faster than digging. Oh, there should be something, right? I don't think there's one. And because this is just dirt, so I think this is the last of it. All right. Hang on, he has a... Huh, that's strange. Okay, yeah, that's something too. He has a waist on his head. Okay. Okay, secrets. Secrets me here and secrets me there. Yep, you always discover something when exploring. Yeah, there's the boss. Okay, uh, let's test out, I don't know, maybe this thing? I mean, you just need to be a little bit careful. Yeah, that did some damage. Yeah, I mean, I heal up pretty much instantly. I do take a lot of damage, that I do. Okay, ow. And yeah, this does a lot of damage too. Not bad. Not bad at all. No, it is still not the spec that I would recommend. Because right now, I mean, I only have 12 strengths. I could get a little bit more here and there if I spec fully into strength. Hmm. Then, I mean, I don't have to spec into wands. Wand is good, especially for long range enemies. But I do have the arrows. Hmm. Yeah, choices. Choices, choices. Well, there's a little bit more loot over here and also a pack of enemies. So I might as well do that. Yeah, might as well kill these people. Just gather them up. Let's see, what did the most damage this one maybe? I mean, it does a lot of damage. 
heal up instantly. Then again, the two-hander one-shot these people. But yeah, it looks like you can very easily just... You don't have to have the best gear. Then again, this is pretty much the next best gear and the best weapons. Okay, but let's check out this thing last. What do we have again? Okay, not legendary. That is fine. Blunt damage is definitely king. So if I get some blunt weapons... I do believe there's a two-hander blunt weapon, like two-handed mace and the one-handed thing. But yeah, not, uh, not too shabby. Not too bad at all. Huh. So the soldier set, I mean, yeah, it, it works. So now I have a spec that is good for exploring and... And I can easily defeat the hollow walls while still not looking like a Power Ranger. And if I also get the blunt weapons, uh, perhaps, perhaps, but I think that should do it for today. So I'm going to say, as always, until next time.